Anytime you're dealing with a Group 31 battery that has a stud type connection like what you see right here, they want to clamp on in that manner like that. And the problem with this type of a connection is when you clip onto this metal stud right here, this stud is really not meant to conduct any kind of current to speak of. Really, the electrical connection on a Group 31 stud type battery is the lead pad that you see right here. So anytime you're going to charge or test the battery, you need to make sure that you get a good connection onto that lead pad. When you get ready to make your connections, the first thing that you want to do is clean that lead pad so that way you've got a good clean surface. One of the things that's easy to use is a little brush like this in a cordless drill. You put it down on the top, give it a little spin like that, and you've polished up that lead connection so it's nice and bright and clean. The next thing you want to do is get down on that lead pad with some type of adapter. Uh, the one that I have right here is a lead adapter, and all you want to do is put it on, thread it down, and snug it into place just like that. At that point, you've got a good connection on that lead pad. The other thing that you need to make sure that you do is make sure that that lead adapter is all the way down on that lead pad and hasn't bottomed out on the top of the stud. Once you've got down tight onto it, you can connect your equipment just like that. Now you've got good clean connections, your battery will charge quickly, and you should get accurate test results.